Hey, how's it going, guys? It is your girl Sleazy here, and welcome to a brand new Let's Play here on the channel. This is called Control. It just came out yesterday, fresh off the press. It got amazing reviews on Metacritic, and all across the board, it rounded at a 90% score rate, which is absolutely amazing. Can't wait to delve into this game with you guys, and without further ado, this is Control. I'll see you guys in the game. Fair warning. This is gonna be weirder than usual. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like we live in a room and there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. The room and the poster. The picture's something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie, what is it called? The prison movie. The room's a cell and the picture, it's different for each of us. It can be beautiful or terrible. But we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Hello? All right, guys. Here? It looks like something over here. Prohibited items reminder. Oh, my sensitivity is really high right now. I gotta... I wonder, I wonder if I could change that. Just looking around, making sure there's nothing that we miss. Let's head up these stairs over here. What is this? This seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. That's how you switch, got it, baby. So there's something over here that we miss. Uh, this is a bathroom. All right, let's head on. Federal Bureau of Control. Federal Bureau of Control. I've been looking for them, control. and they were hiding in plain sight. Oh, I thought that was uh, something that we had to crouch. It's just a window. Is this just a window, too? Yeah. These windows are freaking me out, dude. I keep thinking we can enter and we can't. Okay, we can enter this room. It looks like there's something over here. Right, which way did we come from? I think we came from that way. So let's uh, let's keep on keeping on. There's something over here. 
our, our four reminders and don't think there's anything that we need right now. Uh, Hello? Hey, excuse me. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Mahdi, the janitor, by the way. You'll work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, later, you are no hell of it. There'll be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you mallard. All right. Enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Welcome to the oldest house. Face in my book. Better than somebody with no face at all. <laughs> Think about it. All right, elevator. Here we go. Hopefully something will stop making sense. Poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? Control, baby. Uh, I lose you there for a moment. You know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. Seventeen years since the men of this bureau took him. over here Results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. Oh god, this is actually, I don't like this dude. Oh 
Melee. Melee. Okay. I wasn't sure what to do there. The same gun. Okay. Now I have a gun. Nice, baby. That scared me. So our health bar is in the bottom left hand corner. We gotta keep an eye on that. Oh god. Headshot and you still won't die. Oh god, there's so many of them. Nice, baby. Nice, dude. Who's shooting at me? Oh, I'm getting shot at. Got it, baby. So do we have, which way do we go? Enemy shop health elements, elements went damage. Collect health elements to restore health. All right, what is this? Something's coming. This threat. An attack. Duty as director. Keep the Bureau safe. Did you hear that? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. Things have quieted down outside. Is it safe to go? I don't know, that's a good question. I, um, I honestly don't know what to think so far of this game. Everything's really confusing. Um. Oh! My God! What is that? You can't let this happen. 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 You stopped it. <laughs> you... Oh, thank you. That was... Horror. So I'm assuming these are bad guys? Yeah, they're shooting at me. And there's some health elements over here. I'm definitely gonna need some health elements. Looks like our, our health is still like a little bit low, which is a little bit concerning. But uh, not much we can do at this point, except just keep on keeping on. The hotline. Secure line of communication. Guide us. Reach the hotline. Reach the hotline, all right. The hotline, says the dead man. Okay. Oh God, oh God! Oh, 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 I'm getting shot.
I need health. 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 Yes, I got some health. Who's shooting at me? I feel like there's another guy, but I don't see him. actually happening here. to the oldest house proceed further into the bureau is all it's telling me right now I'm gonna go this way I think hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier the hiss burrowing into everything in this place is the hiss your enemy all right it's our enemy. That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. Our first real boss, guys! We're dead, we're dead. There's any more health. Spreading them. Cleanse the control point. What does that mean? Help me fix it. Cleanse the control point. Alright. Tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. Yeah, I'm Pope, Emily Pope, I'm Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. Oh shit! You're the new director. Hold on, we're coming out. Director, Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Look, somehow this hostile force, this hiss, that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone, not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. 
You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. And Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. Trench is dead. Shot. Ah. I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell her about you yet. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Ugh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions, and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the Bureau she's a part of. Yes. I can try. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. Okay. You with me? We did it before. Push the hiss out. Alright. What am I doing? Ripping it out rips them apart. Alright guys, we're gonna call this an episode right here, right now. Thank you guys so much for watching. And like always, if you guys are new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Alright, we'll catch you guys next.